I'm Nicholas Balancey here at the Congressional Hispanic Leadership Institute Annual Gala with Caitlyn Jenner and Richard Gere as special guests. The organization honored Representative Ileana Ross Leitman for her years of public service and international leadership as the first Hispanic woman elected to Congress. Well, although I have been very critical of the Trump administration on many aspects of his policies, when it comes to uh, advancing human rights in Cuba, in Venezuela, in Nicaragua, he has been right on the money, and I have no complaints. He has, uh, he has understood the difference between right and wrong. He said, I'm standing with the people and not with the regimes. And he has sanctioned more Venezuelan uh, thugs of Maduro than the previous administration. And so in the short time Trump has been there, more than, than the eight years of Obama. And, uh, <clears throat> and Maduro has been bad for an awfully long time and Chavez before him, so it's not like they just turned bad. And with, with Cuba, rolled back uh, the uh, regulations that were one-sided concessions, so, so I thank him for everything that he's done on, in my native homeland and in Venezuela, which is like my adopted land. So I'm very happy with that. Taylor, I wanted to ask you what you would like to see from Congress on the Dreamers uh, specifically right now. Do you think they should give uh, the leaders? Well, I think it's a tough decision for um, Congress and what they're doing right now. Um, and they need to support the people that have been here. Um, and we'll see what happens. Um, uh, but supporting, a lot of them are, you know, great Americans right now. They came here at a very young age and... Uh, so yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm hope they make the right decision. And are you satisfied with President's job performance? Certain, certain areas, yes. Certain areas I am. Trans issues, it's been horrible. Reporting in Washington, I'm Nicholas Ballacy.